Your Lean Business Model Canvas gives a comprehensive view of your business in a concise, visual form. When you're pitching, you need to present your business in a format that makes logical sense to a live audience of funders, investors, or partners. That means sharing the same information that's in your Lean Business Model Canvas, but structuring it so it answers three key questions. What is your business idea? Why will you succeed? And what will the return on investment, or ROI, be? Let's see how you can map the content from your canvas into a logically structured pitch presentation that will capture the attention of your audience. You'll find a starter template for your presentation in this module. So let's start with the first key question. What is your business idea? Funders tend to be impatient, so you want to get to this question right off the bat. Start by clearly stating the problem you've identified and then describing, briefly, the customers who need the problem solved. Once you've demonstrated that, then state your value proposition and describe how your solution delivers value to your target market. Emphasize the tangible benefits your solution will give your customers rather than the technical ins and outs of how your solution works. Congratulations, you've just stated a basic business case or rationale for your business idea. Now you can move on to answering the second key question, why will you succeed? Investors will want to know that you've done your homework. In this part of the pitch, share the findings from your customer discovery process. Funders will be especially interested to hear about the size of your target market and about any socioeconomic trends affecting that market. Next, explain your business model in detail. Most pitches are from three to 10 minutes long, so you don't have a lot of time. But this is your opportunity to explain exactly how your business will make money. You'll want to describe your different revenue streams and the different channels you'll use to reach your target customers. Also, be sure to describe your unfair advantage. Think of this as your competitive edge. Identify the competition and explain why and how your product or service will outperform theirs in the marketplace. Part of your competitive advantage is you and your team if you have one. So take some time during your pitch to mention your knowledge and experience. Give your audience a sense of your character so they understand that you have the entrepreneurial attitudes and skills that will enable you to succeed. That leaves two important blocks of the Lean Business Model Canvas left to address. Cost structure and key metrics. Time to get into numbers. The final and ultimately the most important key question you need to answer in your pitch is this. What will the ROI, return on investment, be? This is a part of your pitch where you must tell a compelling financial story. Now, if you're not a numbers person, don't worry. Mastering the financial part of business is easier than you might think. Just focus on giving your audience the basic information they want to know. For starters, funders will want to know that you have thought about different ways to generate revenue and that you've also worked through all the different costs involved in launching and running your business. They'll want to see some financial projections. These include two kinds of forecasts, a sales forecast predicting how much revenue you'll bring in over a certain period, so your first six to 12 months, and a cash flow forecast showing the flow of income into your business and the flow of expenses going out of your business. Most importantly, funders will want to know the return or the financial reward they'll get by investing in you. If your audience is a lender, they want to know that their investment will deliver a return that will enable you to repay them on time. If they're a granting agency, then they also want to know that their investment will enable you to thrive so that they have the satisfaction of knowing that their money was well spent. Finally, before signing any check, funders will want assurance that you'll spend their funds wisely. So be clear about how much money you're asking for and equally clear about exactly how you intend to spend it. 
That's all there is to telling your financial story. You can use the Excel template in this module to tell yours so that you wrap up your pitch on a strong note.